Hey, hey, hello, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So, um, very quick intro. So, I for some reason just picked up this book and have um, read a little bit since, you know, last time I mood read. And I've now, uh, I'm on 282, um, I almost said chapter 282, but that's not right. Um, I'm a page on 282, so I'm like, you know, let's just start a new mood read video for the uh, the books I've already started a long time ago and see where it goes. So I'm just gonna put you here and I'll be back updating whenever I have something to update about. It's one of those videos apparently, I don't know. I'm just going with it. So, uh, you shall too. I'm joking. Um, yeah, see you in a bit. Oh, hi, I'm back. How are you? <laughs> It's been so long since we last spoke. <laughs> am I <laughs> what? Am I okay? No. Um. So read a bunch of more of um, Gemini. Um. I'm about to start page four hundred seventy-one. <laughs> It's so hard saying like which page I'm starting, um, but this book doesn't have chapters. It's very multimedia thingy. Um, yeah, but I have been reading. Let's see if I can do this with that. I ha I have been reading these kinds of pages. Um, I mean, it, I'm kind of flying by it. Um, it helps when there's a page like this, or page S, um, where you basically can't really read anything on it. Um, but I've had a good couple of just like black pages. And um, yeah, yeah, I, ne I need a little break now. I need a little break. But I have been flying through it and I'm finding it a lot more like engaging i'm more engaged i want to know what happens uh so yeah um how many pages is 659 pages um gonna start 471 so i don't want to do maths anyway i'm gonna take a little break from it because black pages <laughs> they tire me out so i'm gonna continue on with walking on sunshine um oh my so the the um the fonts and spacing in this is so much bigger than uh, in Gemini. So this is I mean this is normal page font, but wow, that's like putting a magnifying glass on it. Anyway, I'm gonna read some of that. I'm feeling very hyper. What is going on? I don't know. Yeah, taking a break from Gemini. Gonna go do some walking on sunshine. No. I'm gonna read the book um, and see what happens. I'm about to start chapter four. Yes, chapter four. And um, I'm, I'm flying at the moment, apparently. I'm flying. Woo, like a little birdie. Woo, la, la, la. I'm gonna, I'll see you in a bit. Hello, I am back with, I'm pretty sure the last update for today. Um, so, Walking on Sunshine, I love how I did that and expect you to see what book I'm holding. Um, Walking on Sunshine, I'm about to start chapter chapter 10. Um, I'm really enjoying it, but the, the enlarged font after reading in German for a, quite a bit um, has me confused. Um, not confused, not me. My brain is confused because it's like I'm holding a ma magnifying glass in front of it. Um, I think I'm going to go to bed. Or at least I'm going to tuck myself into bed. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to continue reading Walking on Sunshine. Let's see. I have Tom here. Can you see Tom? Hey, Tom. Um, I have the rest of piles, uh, pile, piles of books. A pile of books. It's just one pile. I don't think I'm going to continue Gemini tonight because so many black pages. Ooh. Um, I do think I'm going to continue Walking on Sunshine. I don't know if I feel like picking up any of the other books. Nah, don't really. No. 
Okay, um, so I think I'm just going to bring Walking on Sunshine with me and see how much I actually read. If I read or, you know, put a movie on. Because that happens. What do you think, Tom? Should we read or watch a movie? He has absolutely nothing to say right now. That's great from the cat that talks continuously so much all the time. Anyway, I think this is going to be it for me tonight. I will check back in the morning. Because I don't think I'm going to get out of bed just to update. If I do, it's because I can't sleep. And I mean, it's probable. Hey, welcome to my I just woke up hair and I don't give a shit. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. um, So I read a bit. In bed. um, Of... Walking on sunshine. Why do I do it like that? Yeah, how do I expect you to see anything if I do that? So I read up until the three months later thingy. Um, so what just happened? Um, so next I'm about to start chapter 15. Um, so 139 page under 39 um up until now it's been kind of depressing um because you know the friend has i don't know how long ago she passed away but it's it's quite recent um so they're like still in mourning but trying to move on and you know other things in life but it's on their mind all the time and they've just decided because they found a note from their friend pia which basically just just said do it um so uh i think because it's like three months later i think they're about to go on this trip that they um that they talked about in like the last little bit before three months later if they're doing it the way they said they're gonna go uh trekking in peru because why not why not so I'm excited to see that and what's going to happen and so forth. But um, yeah, it's it's been slightly depressing in the mood. It's good, but the mood is a bit sad. And it's, it's making me a little sad, but also I like it. So it's confusing me. I can't believe it's still daylight hours, but I'm going with it. So I, I, uh, I finished this. Yeah. Yes, I did. Um, yeah, so I finished it. Um, turns out, as soon as I actually got into it again, uh, again, it was a breeze. Uh, just, I just had to make sure I didn't read the black pages during nighttime hours because uh, you can't see a bloody thing, can you? So, because I finished that, I decided, you know what, let's just dive into the third and final book because I'm still in like the sci-fi mindset or the Lumine Gemini Obsidio for this one mindset. So I picked this one up. I may have had the right idea because I did read 93 pages. So yeah, I don't know how that happened, but yeah. There, there is two things though. So spoilers, spoiler. I thought that Aiden died, got destroyed in the first book. I may miss be mis <laughs> I may be misremembering this since it was a while ago, but for some reason I I remember him being gone. But he's back. So okay. That's the first thing. Second thing, so in uh in Gemina we have the we have the Heimdall, which is where we are at mostly, and then we have Hypatia. I'm not sure even if I'm pronouncing these things right, but we have the Hypatia on the other side of a wormhole, by the way. So Heimdall, wormhole, Hypatia. But in Obsidio, all of a sudden, he so they they evacuate Heimdall and go into their Mao. Um, so which was like they the Mao people boarded the Heimdall thingy, and now since they had to blow up the Heimdall, they're on the Mao. 
confusion. Um, anyway, so, but the Hypatia is now, has now boarded the Mao. When did Hypatia come through the wormhole? Because the wormhole got destroyed. I, I'm missing a piece here. Because it was all like, we can't cross through because you've opened two timelines or something. And then, yeah, yeah, I don't, I, I don't know. But I'm just going to go with it. I'm just going to go with it. So, there's that. Spoiler over. See ya. <laughs> Morning. Um, so, I've been very much in the mood read situation. So, I decided to, I picked this one up. <laughs> um, and decided to finish the chapter I was on. So, I backtracked like two pages just to recap what, what we were doing. And I finished the chapter. Um, and I am now about to start chapter three. Um, put that one down because it's so slow. It's so heavy and it's so slow. And it's like, oh. But it did make me remember one thing. So there's a pair of twins in there. And the twins are called Charles and Camilla. Yeah, uh, I'll just let you simmer on that for a bit. Um, I then picked up... I owe you one. I read a chapter, so I am about to start chapter three, and that one too. Um, I wasn't really feeling it, so I put it down. So I picked up another, another brick. See, this is how it goes. This is how it goes. This is how I have like a million starter books. Uh, but at least I'm making my way through the starter books this time and not just starting new ones. So anyway, I picked up Guard Your Heart. Um, so I read up until chapter 7, if it's going to focus, um, next, next up is chapter 7. I was a bit more intrigued with this this time, um, this time around. I read one chapter when I started it, wow. Um, so this one really, like, it goes in, right in, like, chapter 1, we go in and this kid, what's his, Aiden. Aiden. Aiden is like beat up uh, and then Iona which is the other perspective of this book she um, she's picked up his phone and is trying to like she's messaged him on Facebook and be like uh, I have your phone I'm sorry for what happened blah 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 let's let's meet up uh, so you can get your phone back and since both of them are from like different size of town like one is very catholic one is very not catholic so aiden is catholic catholic irish and a republican because why not and iona is a protestant and british but they're so they live in what's the town they live in a town <laughs> They live in a town where basically it's the divided, uh, like, it's divided up on which side you're, like, safe on depending on who you are based on your families and if you're, like, Irish or British, basically. Um, so that's what's happening in this one. And I'm, I found it a lot easier to read. I don't know why I put it down last time. Um, but yeah, anyway, so that's my update for now. And I'm gonna go do something else, like have a shower. Yay! Well, hello! Um, so, I think this is gonna be the last update for this week. I think it's just a Monday to Friday week. But, um, I will come back a bit later and, like, sum up all the pages and, uh, stuff and all that. That, the, the, uh, it has a name. <laughs> Wow, okay, so what has been going on? So I actually finished Obsidio, surprisingly. I, I didn't think I would. Uh, I just started it because I was kind of in that zone and I didn't think I would actually finish it, but I did. So there's that. Uh, also, after I finished it, I was just lying in bed thinking I can't go to sleep. Well, I can't fall asleep and uh, there are no books around me. So, on my phone, <laughs> this little tiny thing, I um, looked up the novella, the prequel novella, novella prequel novella, wow, words, um, for the Illuminae files, which, what's it called? Memento. Was that it? 
I'll, I'll put a picture up. Um, so I finished that as well. <laughs> so now I'm finished with the Illuminate files, the whole series. So how did that happen? I don't know. I don't know. So what did I think of it though? So <laughs> where do we even begin? So Illuminate, the first book, which is not featured in this little vlog, because I read it like, I want to say like two years ago, maybe three years ago. Um, I read it some time ago. Well, it has to be more. Yes, because I didn't start the... Oh, anyway, like two, three years ago, something like that. It took me a while to get into because the book starts, I mean, the book starts like just thrown you into the game as it were and you're basically what the fuck is happening so um where the book starts is basically the planet they're on um has been people have come to to do things um <laughs> and they have to evacuate what's the word why am i missing words the only word i can think of is evacuate but people haven't come to evacuate uh people have come to take over so the people on there has to evacuate uh and most people do um the people that don't go on the ships i think it's the alexander and the hippie sure no wait is that what the first oh i'm mixing up words i'm mixing up names i think anyway there's like two ships that go off so in the first book we follow um katie and esra more or less who is a couple <laughs> um but they go on different ships uh, and they also sort of broke up in the middle of things um anyway the ones who uh go away they believe that the people left on the planet Carenza, Carenza 4 um is dead um because you know invasion invasion that's the word i was looking for anyway so there's the whole thing with book one um thrown in kind of trying to figure out what we are doing and also because it's like multimedia um uh, formatted <laughs> wow words i didn't think this one through before i started the camera so i'm just chucking out words uh yeah the whole series is multimedia um so that's the whole thing too i mean it's, it's very cool this one has loads of like uh cartoons drawish um this is like a i i want to say like a beginning of the next part but let's see if i can get ah uh, yeah they have loads of these really cool ones um but they also have loads of this is these ones aren't so bad where are all the black pages now then yeah they have like pages like that and apparently this book has no black pages there we go <laughs> um yeah pages like these are quite hard to read especially when it's dark around you and you only have your little uh night light reading light and uh especially seeing so this because it's a conversation they have like different um shades of shades of gray <laughs> um to like differentiate the different ones and some of them are very unlegible i can't say that word unlegible Un you can't read them <laughs> fuck's sake um you can't read them because you can't really see them you go blind it's like i guess it's like being colorblind i don't know what it's like being no i don't know what i, I don't think i know am i colorblind no i think i'm okay anyway yeah so it took me a while to get into book one and as soon as i was like into book one book one ends and then book two starts with a completely different character and uh, on a completely different ship and even though it's the same kind of i guess plot um it's still a lot you still need to learn get to get to know all these new characters and this new place because they're they're slightly different so 
yeah, I when I started Book Two Gemini, um, was which was a while ago, like two years ago. Um, I couldn't get into it for reasons stated. When this year came along, when 2024 came along, and I was like, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna read these books that I've started, and yeah here we are. So when I then finished Gemini and I started Obsidio, I didn't really have high hopes of, you know, finishing Obsidio this early on, especially not in the same vlog, in the same week. Um, so I'm, I'm mighty surprised. I'm mighty surprised because um, although we see characters from before, we also have new characters to get to know. Um, so, you know, there's, there's that. There's that. There's that. Yeah. As far as reading Obsidio, no, not Obsidio, Memento on my phone, um, it was, it was okay, except, so Memento is a novella. It's only an ebook format, so it's formatted sp specifically for ebooks. So, when you then come to a page, that's just like a very small column which by the way you couldn't zoom into and when you c and you couldn't like uh up the font size or anything like that it just didn't do anything to that certain column page and there was loads of little little text so there is one page of this novella that i couldn't read so i had to skip it um i'm hoping there was nothing specific on there. I don't think I missed much, but still, what were you thinking, people who formatted this? Why couldn't I read that? <laughs> um, yeah, so there, there was one I can read. So the short story is uh, the prequel. So basically we see, well, how the, the attack on Carenza 4, the invasion, starts. And basically when Aiden, the uh the the computer the ship computer thingy the ai <laughs> the ai uh goes broke because <laughs> he does he does anyway i th yeah this has been a lot of waffling i i hope i can edit this bit down to slightly shorter than whatever this is. I'll be back in like a second for you. Uh, I'm just gonna compile the stats and see how much I actually read and from what. Stats coming up. <laughs> 